Hi guys, it's Shani from Yanomize. No, it's not DJ Khalid. And no, I haven't had a shave or cut my hair, but I am on lockdown. Today, you're gonna to see loads of highlights from myself and Matt Watson from Car Wow. Everyone talks about me and Matt when we race and we do drag races. Well, today, you're gonna to see all the best bits. You know, I invented the drag race. Drag races can only happen on Car Wow. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not ready. Come on. Come on, Tesla. I love this car. Just accept it, mate. You're going to regret that, yeah, dude. See ya. Oh, he's got me. Oh, yes. Oh, no. This is the daddy. I think you've had to change gear. Yeah, whatever. This is a Lambo, not a McLaren, yeah? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> this is my turn. Oh, wow. Sweet. So sweet. Not happy at all. <laughs> That's Matt. Great to race with you again. <laughs> so I was asked to um, be on one of Matt's drag races. Didn't really know too much about him. And they invited me down. I turned up, met Matt for the first time. Seemed like a cool guy. Um, the more I got to know him, we seemed very, very different, um, which was cool. And I think it works on camera. I've got Matt here as well. This is Matt from Carwell. Hi. Matt's in the Tesla. I'm in the Tesla. I think this is probably going to give me the, the this closest is the test. It's between you and me, really. No offense, like. No, no, he doesn't even know where he is, so don't worry about him. So G63 and SVR should get destroyed by us. The Tesla and the Aurus. I think I'm going to go off the line first. It's whether you can reel me back in. What? Uh, it is electric, to be fair. It is. The initial videos I shot with him, everyone hated me. All the comments were like, who is this guy? What's this guy? Why is he on the videos? And I was like, wow, this didn't go down too well. However, Matt was like, Jan, come back, shoot some more content with us. After a while. They've missed you as well. They have, they've really missed you. Oh, I've been nice. winning all the races. It's been getting boring. <laughs> <laughs> that's that name, you will? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. So the first drag race ever was myself. I was in the Urus. Matt Watson in the Tesla. Professor Green was in the G-Wagon and the other driver was in the SVR. That was the first race we ever shot. And I went in there being very, very confident. This is my actual Lamborghini Urus that I own. So I know you got all in borrowed car. This is my personal car. I didn't really know too much about Tesla. I'm bored. I've sat here for an hour waiting for you to charge your car. Electric cars. Didn't think it'd be that fast. I thought I'm gonna have it away here. Come on. Or the Urus will absolutely obliterate all the other three cars. How wrong I was. Wow, the Tesla is gone. Bye bye, Yanni. <laughs> Got absolutely dropped. Unbelievable. What an easy win. So I got beat by the Tesla, as you saw, and I was really, really shocked. Oh my God, that Tesla. However, my Aventador S was there as well, and I was like, give me a chance. Let me put my Aventador S up against the Tesla. I don't know, I think I'm gonna get off the line first, because when that thing drops its clutch, it spins up all four wheels. If you look on the floor, you'll see like, it couches out of the, the tarmac, but where that thing has been trying to put down its power. But once it's on song and going, that flies. So I think I'm going to take off first, and it's whether I can, whether the, a quarter mile is short enough for me. Because if it is, I've got you. But do you reckon you're going to do it? After just coming back now, and um, <laughs> after just coming back now and going up against the Aurus, because you remember I was in the Aurus and I know what this Tesla did to me. That's quick. The Aventador is, is a next level quick. I think this is going to be closer than we think, I think than you think. And obviously you watched it. No, I actually think, I think you might take me at the end. You think I might catch you, yeah? Might. It, I, I'm hitting 150. Oh, yeah, so I'm probably doing about 120. Oh really? Yeah. Wow, so I've got, but I'm hitting 150 right, right at the end. So, come on Inventador! <laughs> I'll be honest, I still wasn't that confident because I saw how quick that Tesla was, but I thought my Ventador, it won't let me down. And this is what happened. Oh, no, he's got me. Damn it. He's definitely got me. It's not by much though. I think I lost. I lost from the very beginning. You're so smug, aren't you? <laughs> I had to get payback. This is not 
Morris got beat by the Tesla. I had to get him back. I had to show love to the Lamborghini team. And never fails to disappoint. Come on. If you click here, I actually then put my Aurus against my Aventador. See what happened when them two raced. So me and Matt have drag raced loads and loads of times. I think he's a little bit of a cheat, and I'll tell you why. It's his show, it's his channel, it's his rodeo. So what does he do? He chooses the quicker car. And let's be honest, nine times out of 10, he does. You always drive the fastest car, so let's be fair for once in our lives. <laughs> Well, I think he called me out there, didn't he? You guys always complain that I win, so let's give him a chance. Right, Yanni, you can drive the Tesla. The difference and the advantage I've got is my reaction time, I believe, is quicker than his. I know his reactions are pretty good. I don't know why they are. It's like some kind of ninja. A lot of people always say, Yan, you jump the start. But if you look, if you see the minute her hands slightly come down, I'm gone, I'm off the blocks and I'm away. So that gives me a slight advantage. However, he does choose the quicker cars. Mine and Matt's relationship. I haven't seen it for ages. <laughs> Obviously. Started as strangers. We've become really good friends now. We talk on a regular basis. We've got such a bond on the track. He was excited to see me, wasn't he? I missed him. I love racing against him. We're both very competitive. I'm probably a little bit more. I really don't like losing as you can see from my facial expressions. Come on! Oh my God! Uh, come on! I think that's what makes the videos so great. The way Carwell really? edit the videos are fantastic. The cars they put together to make the drag races really, really work as well. I enjoy it, it's probably the most fun I have on screen. Me and Matt have so much banter. I think I'm a lot funnier than he is. Uh, Matt. Where, where are you? Hold on, hold on. I'm trying to find you. Yeah, yeah, very funny. I'm like about two metres in front of you, that's all. Don't get carried away. <laughs> that BMW. Wow. It just loses everywhere, doesn't it? Stop slagging off my car, otherwise I'll never get another one. <laughs> my extra skills made... My car got ever so slightly faster <laughs> in the end. <laughs> By holding this steering wheel straight. Yeah, is that your extra skills? Look. To be fair, I was that confident I broke late. Smug get. If they've got a camera on Matt running, go back to that runner that we filmed with before. But he does like to, to like to poke and prod and trying to try and get a little bit more out of me. That's how even Yanni drives, all right? And he's a hooligan. Yanni, do you know the funny thing? He's looking over at you. <laughs> watching you, your head just swivel from side to side as you're watching people come past you. <laughs> he didn't win. <laughs> yeah, and he's beaten him. <laughs> Yanni, he's beaten again. This just totally dropped your Lambo. I'm sorry, I think you bought the wrong car. Does that mean you have to give me your Lamborghini? I've got a feeling he should give me his Lamborghini. That got even worse for you then, Yanni, because... <laughs> <laughs> you got off really good there, but I was so in front of your face. When I came past you, your face... You were not happy. You mean it's an Audi? Got an Audi key, got an Audi. <laughs> Centre console, but it's got a ball on the bonnet. You've got some ball coming out of your mouth as well. <laughs> it's literally, it's just, we just go at each other. There's nothing set up. It's such a gift. Oh man, I just want to beat him. My God, how close do you sit? To the steering wheel. That's because I haven't got a big belly in the way. <laughs> wow. you got to remember, I can lose weight. You can never get taller. <laughs> It's just real and it's just natural and I think that's why the audience really, really enjoy it. And that's why you guys at home seem to enjoy our videos together. I'm gonna beat you, I'm gonna beat you. What happened, mate? What happened? I, I think I lost. I lost from the very beginning. Matt is definitely a, um, a Tesla fanboy. Electric versus rotten dinosaurs. Come on, Tesla. Come on, Tesla, come on, come on. Yes, Tesla. Oh, Tesla's so quick. Yeah, Tesla. When he's coming past me, he looks back and he's like, bye bye, Yanni. Bye bye, Yanni. Bye, bye, see ya. Bye bye. Goodbye. <laughs> see ya. Bye bye. It's a win for the Tesla. It's a win for electric power. He tries to come at me over the color of my cars or the wrap. I'm not some kind of light hooligan. With a bright reflective car. <laughs> nice color. I'm not sure that rose gold's gonna 
help you with this, but anyway. You just have everything normal. I'll have my car in grey. I'll have my car in black. Uh, standard, doesn't want to do anything to it. Yeah, he's got a G-Wagon in red. Really? Take your G-Wagon to Knightsbridge, mate, and leave me in my 4x4. I'm forever laughing, and I love to laugh, and I've got like a mad, loud laugh, and I know Sam, who edits the video, she makes me look like Muttley. <laughs> but it literally is that. I just can't help but laugh. It's so, so funny. And as I said, me and Matt are so different, with different characters, with different personalities, and I think that's why it works. <laughs> I think Matt's main passion is obviously cars, like myself. And I think initially I was one that always wanted to win and he was like, okay, cool. And as I said, he picked the faster car. Now, Matt wants to win. I've really brought out the competitive side in here, man. You can see he's a bit more hungry. He's got that look in his eye and he's like, I want to win. I want to beat Yanni today. Hopefully, I'm going to beat Yanni because if I don't, he will be unbearable. <laughs> I'm giving it all that I can. Come on, Tesla. Come on, BMW. Got to beat Yannick. Come on. So I want to beat him. <laughs> yes. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. What do you think about that, Yanni? Oh. Who's the bigger cheater? So I would say Matt, and I'll tell you why. He's done a roof race, the McLaren against the Aventador. With the McLaren, what do you do? You push the button and the roof comes off. With the Aventador, I've got to get out, pop the roof, take one pod out. Go back round, take the other pod out. He cheated. Tires, he'll warm up his tires and then he'll make me sit there for about four or five minutes while my tires cool down and then we accelerate. Oh. Yeah, stop talking so my tires can get colder. You think I'm an idiot? And then make sure you time it just right when you throw the throttle and then lift off the brake. Come on, race! He always says, just one more, just one more. With the tug of war, I beat him once, twice, three times. Uh, let me just try this. Can we just do one more go and see what happens? Let me just try that. I promise you, Yanni, this is the final time. Matt, you lost. Just, just accept it. Okay, right. I'm going to tell you backwards. I'm going to tell you backwards. You've got to stop this, mate. Come on, you've lost. He's trying to kill my car. <laughs> He'll always find one way to cheat or get the edge. On the road, right, you can't go faster than that. So let's call it a draw. No, no. Oh, too bad, man. It's, it's heads. Yes. <laughs> Such a cheat! Do you know what? He always cheats. Cheat. But I'm quick off the line. I've got my reaction time. And I hope when Gus edits this video, he's going to show you second by second when her hands come down and as the car's pulling away, you'll see that I've got it on point. Yeah, granted, a couple of times I might have gone slightly earlier, but usually I get it on the button. My favourite race, he was in a Tesla, I was in my Chrome Turquoise Aventador and I remember pulling away and I was like, I messed the start, I messed the start and I never usually mess up the start and I knew I'd messed it up. Come on Tesla, come on, come on. Oh, I messed the start, come on. And he was gone and all the way down I'm saying I messed the start and I'm like, hold on, hold on a minute, I'm catching him. No, what, what? And I went past him. Please, 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 please. <laughs> Even though I messed the start, I still got you. <laughs> That is my favorite race ever. <laughs> you can tell how much I wanted to win that. Matt's favorite race ever, I know, is the McLaren 720 Aspider against my Aventador S Roadster. That is his favorite race. And I think it's because I was so far ahead, I thought I had it won. I'm like this and I've turned around to look at him like, where is he? Oh, you are gone, mate. Where are you? And he's got me. <laughs> I'm coming back, come on. Come on, McLaren. Come on, McLaren. Come on, come on. See ya. Oh, he's caught me. And literally, he picked me just at the post. No! So that's Matt's favorite race. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, that felt so good. I don't believe that car was standard. That's the honest truth. And it was too quick at the end. I had it won. Am I being a sore loser? How do you catch me? Was the McLaren souped up? 10.4 seconds. Was my Ventador not fast enough? 10.5 seconds. I don't know. I believe he cheated though. 
Oh, I'm still so annoyed. Matt let me drive a Tesla, I think, I think it was a Model S, and I was shocked at the speed. When I put my foot down, and I've been in fast cars, the G-force that pulls you back, I couldn't believe it, and I was like, oh my God. <laughs> and what the weird thing is, there's no sound. So that means your head is trying to like, work out what's going on, because there's no noise to think, okay, I'm getting faster, I'm getting faster. It's just straight G-force. 100 mile an hour, 110. 120. Honestly, it gave me a headache. I couldn't believe how fast a Tesla is in ludicrous mode. That thing is insane, isn't it? Your head spins. I I'm actually shocked, like, wow. Yeah, don't get too carried away though. You'll start to use it too much battery power. We haven't got the charging cable with us. <laughs> so obviously we do the drag race, we do the rolling race, and then we do the brake test. The rolling race, when it's a Tesla, it's instant power and usually you lose. But he always says to me, listen, what gear do you want to put in? Do you want to go second gear, third gear, 30 mile an hour, 40 mile an hour? So he's quite fair on that. The brake test, again, reaction time. I'm really good with that. The issue is a couple of times I've actually missed the end and I've just continued going on and he's broke. Um, do I brake a little bit early? I don't know. I do like hitting the brake on the line and then we're there. Sometimes we're really, really neck and neck and we'll look left and we'll look right. But that's also fun. But I've said it many, many times. The drag race is what it's all about. Yes! No idea. I've got to have got him. If you win the drag race, it doesn't matter about the other two. But Matt will always try and do something. He might stick it in reverse or leave it in neutral. He'll come up with some plan to win. Well done, Yanni. Just stay there a second. I think you won. I did. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. No, you didn't. What happened? <laughs> oh, you lost. So what have we got coming up? I know there's going to be loads more drag races. He did initially say, let's get our mums to race. I'll be honest, my mum wasn't up for it. However, I said, let's get our girls to race. So I've got a fiance, he's got a girlfriend, and we're going to get them to race. What I said was, let's put them in the same car. At least that way, it's fair. Um, so we're going to try and maybe set up a race where they're both in the same car, maybe a manual, and then they're both in an automatic. And then one will race me and one will race him. And overall, we'll see who's got the best, the best pairing. Me and my missus, or him and his missus. When we spoke on Instagram Live, Matt was like, well, I'm gonna get my missus to really practice hard and stuff like that. He's always gotta find a way to win, or is it cheating, or is it being clever? I don't know, but I might get my missus to um, train as well, but she knows she's a good driver. So I'm confident, I'll be honest. My missus actually raced before, so when we had Yanni Supercar Customizer, we had a drag race section. If you click here, you can actually see that video. Matt was not happy. He was really upset that I'd done a drag race without him, but it was for the TV show. He's gone and done a drag race with someone else besides me on his channel. I've just been on your YouTube channel. I've noticed you've done a drag race without me. You've been cheating on me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Matt, again. Guys, let me know. Me and Matt will obviously do more and more drag races. Comment down below and say, Yang, we'd like you in this car. Matt, we'd like you in this car. Or. Shall we both be in the same car and see actually who is the best driver? Also, who else do you think would be cool to race with myself and Matt? Obviously, we can put four cars, even five cars in a row. It'd be cool to get some other people on board. People have got banner, people are funny. I've seen Matt have other guests before. Some are great, others, they've got no idea how to launch a car. And I've seen the comments, the comment section in the car wow videos, they don't play. They will go in on you. <laughs> <laughs> they don't care. Um, but let me know, who else? Comment down below. If you want to see the live with myself and Matt Watson on my Instagram, click here, you can see that. Since me and Matt have started filming, um, Carwell channel has grown massively. If you look, you can see from the start to where they are now, unbelievable, but it's a great channel to follow. So guys, subscribe to Matt's channel, Carwell. So that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, special mention to Matt and Carwell. Thanks so much for inviting me down. I enjoy the videos and um, Let's hope we can shoot many more together. Guys, stay home, stay safe, and um, hopefully we'll see you soon. Take care, see you later.